Now at 10, the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo has awarded nearly $10 million in scholarships to almost 500 students across the state. That money will be put toward college or university in Texas, and many of these students have compelling stories. Zach Tawatari spoke to one from Cyprus who proves in life it isn't about where you come from, but where you're going. For about half of his 18 years, I was really young. Cypher High School graduate Wyatt Lewis has had to learn to march. Yeah, it was difficult. To his own beat. A lot of people, they have the chance of, at a very young age, they have a chance of seeing someone that they idolize and wanting to be that person. On my side, I saw someone who I didn't want to be. Today, his future is bright. The recipient of a $20,000 college scholarship from the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. But what he's had to overcome to get here is hard to imagine. Like I'm not going to see my dad again um, outside of a jail. And my mom, she'll get out. She'll get out. She's been, they've been in there for, I think, eight years now. At the age of nine. Like maybe a week before my birthday. Wyatt's parents were convicted of a murder. It happened at like 3 a.m. one night. Um, they sat us down and they, they told us what happened um, and what's going to happen from here on out. For the time being, he and his brothers would stay in the trailer they grew up in with their grandparents. Uh, it wasn't the best position for us, um, especially for any kid to grow up in. But in stepped his new guardians, his aunt and uncle, who lived in Cyprus, where Wyatt would become an Eagle Scout and graduate from Cypher High School. That's whenever I found something I idolized and someone I idolized. So I kind of got both sides of it, knowing what I don't want to do and what path I don't want to take and what path I do want to take. Wyatt is among almost 500 students who receive money from the over $22 million in educational funding the Rodeo Awards. So many of them are the first in their family to graduate high school, the first in their family to go to college. Uh, it's just another testament of rewarding those young people so they can go do what they want to do. And for Wyatt, who plans to be the first in his family to finish college and is headed to Texas A&M, the past doesn't define his future. Determination, you know, working towards a goal, knowing what you want, and that may change. Um, but as long as you end up where you want to be, it'll always work out. Zach Tawatari, KHOU 11 News.